Meanwhile, the last may not have been heard of the second term ambition of Governor Babajide Sawo in Lagos. Insinations are beginning to appear true about another prominent party member, Mr. Oloran Femi Mustafa, getting ready to give him a run for his money. Mustafa is a retired permanent secretary in the state civil service. During the week, he also submitted his APC governorship nomination form. To look at this possibility and other relevant issues, we are now being joined by political affairs analyst, Otumba Bestman Unze Jambo. He is the president of Team Nigeria for Change. Good evening, Otumba. Hello. Hello, I can hear you. Oh, okay. We can establish the connection. I can hear you. Good evening. Thank you for joining us on our primetime news. <laughs> now, it started as a rumor that... Uh, Mr. Mustafa Lauren Femi was going to give uh, the incumbent a run for his money. Then uh, I had the Commissioner for Information, the State Commissioner for Information, on one of our bulletins uh, over the weekend last week uh, to talk about this. Uh, but then he refuted it as a rumor as well. But then sh shortly after that, a few days after, during the week, we heard that it's, oh, he had also submitted is nomination form. What's going on in Lagos? Our democracy is going on in Lagos. Beautiful <laughs> democracy. And <laughs> the game of Lagos. So we can come to the contest again in the democracy. And then we are happy that we the more the merrier. So it's okay. Yes, the more the merrier, uh, okay? That sounds like a beautiful rhyme, the more the merrier. But again, uh, what about internal democracy? How are you going to, uh, it's just a few days to the primaries, and how are you going to ensure uh, that uh, the party uh, puts forward a formidable force at the primaries? Well, you know, it's, um, it's a beautiful thing. It's, uh, we have an incident governor. Governor Vadis Oulu, who has done extremely well for the last um, three years plus. And then, um, yeah, you will go to the primaries with um, the other candidate who submitted his nomination form, and the delegate, if it is delegate election, if it is direct primaries, so Vadis so Oulu will take him there. But I can tell you one thing is sure. Baba Jiden Soulu has done extremely well to deserve a second term ticket to deserve um, to win the general election from 2023. So the party is putting everything in place for a smooth, free, fair, and incredible farmers to choose um, the flag bearer for the All Progressive Congress. And, what? and that's what we're going to have in Lagos. Otumba. Otumba, yeah, let, me, let me ask you in strong terms. Let me ask you in strong terms. Um, this gentleman, Mr. Lauren Femme Mustafa, is it going to be uh, a kind of, I don't want to use the word, the word uh, porn, but is it going to be some kind of game changer for uh, Ashwaji in Lagos? Um, even the way you call, the way you call his name shows that he's, um, he's not he's not known. Um, he's basically a person. Yes, I learned. Don't, put me, Otumba, Otumba, don't, don't know, put me in trouble, Otumba. Otumba, don't put me in trouble. Don't put me in trouble. I just addressed him as a gentleman, Mr. Olorofemi okay. Mustafa. Okay, okay. So one thing is, some of us are hearing his name for the very first time. Majority of the delegate are hearing his name for the very first time. And then um, you can't win a delegate election if you are not known. But that today, Sawolu is the incumbent governor, known to everybody, who has performed extremely well, who is also, who is also, um, uh, as you have met, Tenobu's candidate. So I don't think. There is any issue with uh, a lot of family Mustafa, like you said. Um, and I don't think uh, he can do anything 
to boost by the terms of archaeological and measurable in the presidential powers. Negotiations with Kano Saoli and Saoli will stand with archaeological and measurable. Well, I met you know, also will stand with Saoli. Hmm. Okay. So, are you joining forces? This may be my last question to you. Are you joining forces uh, with uh, the state mouthpiece to say that uh, the, the very candidate that the, well, popular kingmaker, so to speak, in Lagos, Ashwaju Balatinumbu, is pushing forward, is still the incumbent, and he has no hand whatsoever in the candidacy or the interest of this man, Mr. Lauren Femi Mustafa. Is that what you're saying? And my, um, you know, in politics, you don't speak in the tone of finality. But with what I know, and with the information at my disposal, I should have to go to the the principled man and the straightforward man. Just last week, he raised the hand of Saul in endorsement for second term. The endorsement does not mean there can be other candidates because it's a democracy. But Bola Ahmed Tinubu stands with Saolu. Saolu stands with Bola Ahmed Tinubu. And Lagos stands with Saolu. You played me very smartly there uh, by not saying uh, you were giving your final, uh, a tone of finality to, to your answer. Because we have you on record. And of course, if anything changes, we have to call you back again uh, to, to address the last thing you said. Okay, so uh, in politics, there are, there are no permanent friends, only permanent interests. Exactly. Thank you very much exactly. for your time. That was Otumba Best Man Unze Jambo, is a president of uh, Nigeria for Change, Team Nigeria for Change. Thank you. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.